Today, we're gonna to show you one of the most cost-effective things you can do to help the heating and cooling performance of your home. Let's go have a look. Okay guys, here we are. This is an exhaust fan, a very common exhaust fan, and it has no damper. Now, when you're heating a home, heat rises, and this is one of the first points where you're gonna lose a lot of air or conditioned air out of your building envelope. Now, there is a solution for this. Let's go check that out. So these are the draft stoppers that we're gonna be using today from Tight House, which are gonna be going over top of these older exhaust fans, retrofitting a damper. Uh, these have an integrated R value. They're made in Australia and they're very solid construction. They're a one piece. So they've also got a radiant barrier on the lid, which during really hot climates, which we do get a lot of in here in Australia, uh, you get some protection from that radiant heat up in the roof. An exhaust damper works. Once the fan is turned on, it pushes the flap open. And this is what is gonna give us an air barrier that will be flexible for when you need exhaust ventilation and when you don't and you want a comfortable living space. So overall, the exhaust tight damper is a cost-effective and high-performing solution. So there are new exhaust fan solutions these days with integrated dampers. This one in particular is from Tight House, but it's got an integrated draft stopper, which is a lot more engineered specifically for the actual fan unit itself. What we're gonna be doing today is actually retrofitting a damper over old exhaust fans that are already in place and already been installed. So right now we're moving 4,000, around 4,200 meters cubed an hour. So hopefully once we install these draft stoppers, we should reduce the airflow or the leakage rate of this home by about a quarter. So let, let's do that. All right, so here we are. We've just done an air tightness test with and without the exhaust dampers. And it's gone from around 20 air changes an hour, now down to below 12 air changes an hour, which is a pretty significant change considering how minimal the effort was to install these dampers above the exhaust fans. Okay, so we've had an amazing result from the retrofit of our exhaust dampers on this home today. Go to tighthouse.com.au for more information.